Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and all the people in between. Um, since this was so much fun yesterday with the scorpion video, I was thinking I should try to resume my ritual of doing a video on Monday, one on Wednesday, and one on Friday, and if I didn't manage that um, to do the Zodiac Sunday, and I know this category used to be called a puffin named Monday, today we should rather call it a shark named Bruce, because my stapler is called Bruce the shark. Um, and of course, obviously, there is no puffin in the picture today, but um, the phrase of the day deals with working what is there. And the phrase of the day is Nathan Kenner Naktri Kone Ad Spinner. The need teaches a naked woman how to spin yarn. And uh, yeah. Since I'm obviously sending this art journal to someone and internationally the most socially accepted naked people are merfolk, I decided the sea creatures are taking the trash from the sea like the old fishing nets and uh, joining hands to make something constructive out of it. Uh, Bruce the shark is actually has the one job to um, make the paper heavier so it doesn't flip up. Uh, but here I also thought there is a, a fish with a sawing nose. Um, I don't know if that exists in reality, but uh, like in a lot of uh, my childhood books, it existed sort of as a joke. A uh, fish uh, called sag, a fish uh, sawing fish that opened up nets and cans and all that for the other sea creatures. And yeah, I'm thinking a lot of uh, fishing nets recently because, believe it or not, I do eat fish and I like eating fish and it's good for my central nervous system. But I also, of course, feel for the whales and other creatures that get caught in the nets, especially unwantedly. So, uh, and I read an article uh, the other day about like a fishing village that uh, bases its economy on lobster fishing and you need really specific machinery for lobster fishing if you don't want to endanger the Nordic right whales or whatever species that was. Uh, and yeah, you always have to see uh, the two sides of the coin and okay, I'm not fishing personally um but i'm trying to bring people together at one table also because of my disability because i always will need a support bubble of a variety of people um but especially with the disability i also have to remember this phrase um it may take a long time to get specific help if I need specific help so I have to improvise with what I have like honestly um, in the house I walk comparatively well without a stick so when I'm going out I often forget that I need a stick for curbs and the like and now I have to kind of position myself so I can paint while I'm blabbering um so what happened i forgot the sticks i forgot to take the sticks from my bed to the apartment door which is not a big deal inside the house but uh like the only thing that i found beside the door was an umbrella so actually i waddled to the mailbox uh with an umbrella that was like really exhausting and in the beginning, I was also quite scared, I must say. Um, 
but it turned out quite right. I mean, I wouldn't do this every day, but uh, yeah, I have to make do what is there. And even like if this ugly color comes out of some mixture that I did, uh, let's test the color. And this color is very good in a mermaid hairdo. I should manage to hold this camera straight. Um, yeah, even as a disabled person, I am critical of the idea of making like old buildings and wild landscapes wheelchair accessible sort of by by force of the government. Um, because like even the governments don't know everything about the the life reality of all people. So like in some cases I have experienced it as more important to uh, be open-minded and to think uh, think up a solution that is not uh, that was not thought of uh, from the beginning like uh, let's say of course I'm aware that in reality uh, the animals don't need handbags but uh, here I wanted to spread some humor for all the crap that's happening in the world and uh, yeah I wanted the manatee to have a handbag and I wanted the manatee to crush it because the manatee doesn't have fingers and of course I have fingers but I don't have hand coordination so I can't knit but occasionally a lot of uh, old ladies and also younger ladies try to teach me how to crochet um, because I only technically need one hand and I mean there are probably so many fishing hooks in the sea that let's create a story of uh, knitting something out of uh, sea trash and uh, let's remember to remember to remember the endings of Icelandic words <laughs> because I really had to google this uh, phrase so I would write it right uh, as most of you may know or guess I speak Icelandic with my very own grammar but also there I have to make do with what is there and uh, have I mentioned I love this water pen because uh, it doesn't spill so I even dare to use it on the keyboard and it makes do with very little water so it's very economical and like it helps me to create a story around such phrases so do create a positive story about uh, yourself tell me phrases in the comments that I could uh, do in the art journal and on the YouTube channel and stay safe. Bye bye.